Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Coming to you from the house again. Um, actually just finished up rigging up here, getting ready to go out. I got about two hours or so um, to get in some fishing here tonight. So I'm gonna try and get back out there. Um, I do have um, some redemption that I'm seeking. I want some revenge on my home body of water that's right down the street. That's the first place I'm going to. Um, I want redemption. I hooked into some fish there the other day um, within 15 minutes. Two fish, hooked into them, got good hook sets into both of them. Um, if you're watching that video, uh, that was the last video that posted um, with them coming off. So you already know, hooked into two of them, lost both of them. Um, so I want some redemption. I'm going for a redemption today at that particular body of water. And then we're also going to check out a smaller pond that's down the road a little bit, about 10, 15 minutes um, from my home lake here. Um, and just see what's going on at that pond. Um, really, the last few days what I've been doing is just really pond hopping local area here just to kind of get a sense of what's going on in the waters around me. Um, whether those fish are still confused with the weather or if they're starting to move around. Like I said, weather's been hit or miss. Uh, last two days here, been in the 60s, real nice and warm. A little bit breezier today, but a little bit warmer today. A little bit better sun today also. So I'm assuming that the bite will be similar to the last time I went out with fish looking for those moving baits, getting active, starting to think about spawning, starting to move around a little bit. So we're going to get out there. Like I said, we are on a redemption mission today. So come along and let's get after it. to the next pond and the first spot I see there's a bed fish right here it's right in front of us here so we're gonna try and get him it's a decent size decent size we're gonna try seems pretty locked on <laughs> All right, guys, first bed fish. I'm gonna get some higher ground here. Oh, he swung, he came back around on it, guys. He does not like it in that one spot. I mean, he already. Alright, so I've already found the back of his bed that he doesn't like. He likes it like right on the back side. I would brought him right past him. Let's turn it on it again. Oh, he's nosing it, guys. He's nosing it. So we're getting him riled. A lot of things go bunk on. Let's see if that gets him. Oh yeah, I can definitely see that a lot better. Hey, 
definitely doesn't like the crawl guys. <laughs> all right guys i think that's definitely an upgrade right off of his bed we'll get a quick weight 3.62 guys 3.62 solid solid fish solid 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 fish all right get the release there he goes <laughs> all right guys I think we got another customer here quicker there he is oh. That's another three pounder for sure. <laughs> oh. Oh. On that craw again. Oh no, that's definitely, that's gonna be close to four. Three point six six. Oh, that's a nice fish, guys. Absolutely beautiful fish on that bed. I thought he was smaller than the last guy. He's actually bigger. Oh, all right. We'll get the release, guys. in the grass straight back to the bed all right guys so the cracking car is putting in work um absolutely demolished by both fish i mean the second guy really only took like five minutes really and really it was because of the wind could have had him sooner i mean he was keyed in right away the crack and crawl in his bed at all and I might uh, need a new bait here but I'm trying to get the life out of this guy I don't know if it's the same one but we found another pass it might be the first one that we caught him back up on his uh, same bed so we'll see if he's interested Oh, 
Okay, so on our next customer. I cannot see him at all, but he's there. Just look too good not to be true. That's why you flip even bets that you really can't see too much on. All right, guys. So uh, I'm at home. Had to rush home, didn't do an outro, typical video here on the, on the channel. I forget to do an outro. But um, at home now, have to make dinner, wife's coming home soon. But exciting, exciting day today out on the water, guys. Found our first bed fish of the season. First bed fish, guys. First bed fish. Okay, let that sink in. I know it's around that time. Some of you are like, wow, he's really excited for no reason. No, you don't understand. The weather has been absolutely crazy the last few days. We went from 70s to 40s and 50s to wind blowing. Now we were 60s the last few days. It has been absolutely crazy. So for me to find some bed fish that were legit locked on, they were not skittish at all. They ate almost immediately. The second fish, as you guys saw, and as I was saying in the video, literally the first or second flip into him, he was ready. He swung back around on it, and almost I almost hammered him home right then and there. Um, I wasn't expecting him to eat that quickly, so I wasn't ready for him. First fish took a little bit. Uh, that was the first fish that we saw, so got a little bit hyped. Um, in the video as far as uh, I'm seeing him. So I didn't expect to see bedfish there. Um, that was the second pond we went to. Today, definitely found that redemption at another body of water, a smaller pond that definitely is warming up. Um, so it was good to see. Beds everywhere. Tongue, the most beds I've seen in one spot uh, so far. That's a good thing, but it's also bad because literally on the drive home I, I have the window open right now but literally on the drive home we've lost like six or seven degrees temperature is taking a turn for the worst um tomorrow they're saying 44. we went from 65 today 66 44. so those bed fish probably i don't know they might not be there tomorrow they might move back out a little bit if they do they're not going to be too far those guys were pretty locked, so I'm, I might take a ride over there tomorrow. I might take a ride over there tomorrow. We'll see if the curiosity gets the best of me. Um, and I want to see the other beds there. I, I didn't find a third one that we couldn't see and we couldn't get to commit right away. Um, he hit it the first time, and then after that, that was it. So I don't know what his deal was. All solo males. So um, I can only imagine the females that they'll pair up with here in a couple of days, hopefully. So they're supposed to get this cold snap for one day. Then the next couple of days are supposed to be warm again. So they're going to be out there checking them. Um, this pod's not too far from the house, so definitely going to be checking out on them. Um, so again, guys, exciting video. Uh, like I said, my favorite time of the year as far as bed fishing goes. And super stoked to get the first two bed fish of 2020 here on this video. This outro is going way too long, so I'm going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, be sure to smash that thumbs up. Be sure to hit the notification bell so you guys are up to date on the most recent uploads and when they go live. Um, so videos I'm sure are going to start piling up here. I actually have um, this, this video and another video were in my library already. So I'm already stacking videos here for you guys. So videos should be coming a little bit more regular um, and a little bit more fast and furious. So again, guys. Be sure to hit those notification bells and subscribe to the channel. And be sure to check the link in the description for the Instagram. Go ahead and give me a follow there. Definitely a lot of previews went out today of all the fish on Instagram. Um, so definitely go check that out and give me a follow there. I hope you liked today's video. Again, hit that thumbs up if you liked it. And we will see you on the next one.